Howdy everyone, Mr. Kazi here with another problem of the week. Today we're going to look at the ideal gas law. So get out your periodic table, get your calculator, and let's get ready to do a great problem. What is the volume of 17 grams of ammonia gas at STP? Well, the first thing we want to do is we want to analyze the problem. And we have volume, is what we're looking for. And then we have a gas, and we have STP, which means standard temperature and pressure. So this is a job for the ideal gas law. So off to the magic blackboard. The ideal gas law is pressure times volume equals moles times R and temperature. And R is just the ideal gas uh, constant. So P is pressure, V is volume, N is moles, R is the ideal gas constant, and T is temperature. So we have one atmosphere, uh, that is the standard pressure, one atmosphere, and we're looking for the volume. We know that the R is 0 0.08206 liter atmospheres per mole Kelvin. And then our temperature, of course, is going to be uh, 273 uh, Kelvin, which is uh, temperature for standard temperature and pressure. And uh, the thing we're missing here is moles. So let's take our grams and convert it to moles. Grams per mole. Well, we know that in ammonia, there is one nitrogen, and that's going to be 14.01 grams. That's grams per mole. And three hydrogen, and that's three times 1.008 grams. Add those together, and we get 17.034 grams per mole of ammonia. Now, that's the molar mass, grams per mole. And we can take that and use that to convert to moles. So, 17 grams times one mole is 17.03 grams. And we know to write it this way so that our grams cancel out. And plug and chug, and we get 0.998 moles of ammonia. Now we can take them now, put that in the... Uh, equation for n. So write our equation down again. And uh, let's go ahead and manipulate this so we have volume. Just a little bit of algebra. Whatever you do to one side, you do to the other. You can do anything you want, just do it to both sides. So now we have volume equals nRT divided by pressure. So let's go ahead and plug it in. Love to plug and chug. All right, now let's cancel our units just to make, always check your unit analysis then you know you've set the problem up right. All right, everything's in the right place and we have liters left and liters are exactly what we want. Plug and chug and we get 22.4 liters of ammonia and that's using three sig figs, not too hard. The ideal gas law is uh, fairly easy to use and of course STP which we need to remember is standard temperature and pressure. And standard temperature and pressure is zero degrees uh, Celsius, which is 273 Kelvin. And pressure is one atmosphere or 760 uh, millimeters of mercury, depending on uh, what method you might be solving for. And then we need to be able to change grams to moles. And changing grams to moles uh, is very easy. Just use the molar mass. And the same thing from changing moles to grams. Just use the molar mass. Well, that's uh, it for now. Be sure to uh, check out my websites. If you have any questions, send an email to Mr. Kazi at mrkazi.com and go to mrkazi'sworld.com uh, if you need to or would like to. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. 